All right, hi. Stream number nine. I took um, I uh, took a break from Terraria, as you can probably tell by my YouTube channel stuff. Because I just wanted it something different, not because I'm bored at all. I'm actually really excited. This is like the best part of this mod. Um, what we did last time, I believe, was we killed some mech bosses. I don't think I've done anything in between these episodes. So the next one that we have to do is Skeletron Prime. And this boss, I looked into it. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it because it's just like a rare chance, I think. So let's grab a... Oh, I can't craft one. Okay. Uh, I need Souls of Night. Well, luckily for me, you can buy those. So I'll buy a few. Um, I'm gonna need to get some money eventually. I might set up a little farm in the, um, in the, uh, what's it called? <laughs> in the dungeon for, for some stuff. I guess I'll, I'll, actually, I'll just do that after Plantera, so I can get Ectoplasm as well. So, we have a bunch of bosses to do today. I plan on going up to the Mirage. Maybe not killing the Mirage, but up to the Mirage. So, I also looked into getting something on obs or not getting something but changing a setting i've realized I've ne i never use the track system oh i need life roots okay before before we fight this is get life roots but i never use the um the track system and what the track system does is i can have my audio as one file and the game audio as another so i can adjust that in the editing when i make the video um just in general hmm okay yeah it doesn't look likely that we're gonna find um what was that all right Let's head back, though, and I guess we'll just do... What's this? Whoa. I've never seen this weapon before. That actually seems like a good pre-hard mode weapon. Like, as, like, a melee weapon, that actually seems decent. That's interesting. I never knew that was even in the game. Uh, I think it's vanilla as well. All right. Well, we can... We have the spawner on. No, I don't. I put it away. All right. Make it nighttime, and we're do skill the Skeletron Prime fight. Here we go. All right. Let's use this so we can get some damage off. Nice. I think we'll probably use- Oh my god, it's being destroyed. Yeah, bows are gonna be really good because we got this accessory, which is- It's, uh, it's like- It's a better- I think it's a better magic quiver, pretty much. So bows are just gonna do way more damage than anything else right now. Yeah, you can definitely see that. <laughs> this is so much damage. Look at the DPS, I'm getting around almost 3,000 already. I- it, th that might change later. I don't know what weapons I actually need to- to get, so I'll, I'll probably look into that as well. As of right now, bows are definitely better, so you can keep using this. I don't- does this even do damage? Oh, no, that still does good damage. Okay. I want to get more of the morphs, because I love them so much. I don't know why, but something about them are just really cool, and it's, it's a fun idea that you can morph into a thing, and it's, like, kind of a whole class. Wow. <laughs> we demolished that. Okay, so Souls of Fright here. Um, we can make a ranged weapon called Sandstorm. Shape this. Oh, wait, there's two. We can also make this one. Okay, what? can we make both? Oh, we can. Okay, let's make both and see which one's better. So this one, there's a ton of damage. Ooh, whoa. Okay, so that one, 45 second. Well, I got plus 50% damage. Oh, 50% longer cooldown. That might be worth it, actually. And then we have this one plus 10 defense also there are like these really cool reforges that we can get on them oh that's what it does how long does it last it's very hard to control <laughs> it's really hard to control does it just last forever wait what button do you press to get out of it oh this is one you can just always use forever okay that's nice to know then so yeah we will keep them both on me okay <laughs> wow that's cool uh, oh, wait, we can summon these summons in. I was going to do that earlier, and I didn't. Okay, so let's go ahead and make another Hydra food. I realized while I was editing the last video, it's Hydra food, not meat. I do apologize. All right, and then let's uh, compare this to this. Okay, so we did all of that for nothing. It's trash. All right, get out of my inventory. <laughs> all right, next boss, Scourge Fighter. I think you summon that with the scourge yeah i saw that scourge we can craft one of those at night time so we can go straight to spawning this you know i'm not even gonna get life roots all right not even a point all right let's use this and see if it's any good because all right i don't like it i don't like it i'm dead <laughs> i don't like that i don't like the skeleton prime thing it has 75 that's actually a lot of health all right let's just maneuver around it oh some of the things the minions oh well this have a lot of health whoa what is going on there? It's like a bullet hell fight now. I do not like that. You turn invincible for this. Oh my god, that did a lot of damage. I guess it's really good for enemies that are hard to hit. Yeah, because this thing is... Oh gosh. Maybe we should get life roots. Okay. Oh, it's still here. What the heck? What's it doing? I can't read the chat. Uh, missile strike incoming. Okay. 
Okay, so once it does, like, the thing where it just summons in, like, a bunch of, uh, thing that come down from the sky, it gets a bit chaotic. You have to keep flying. Oh, that does a lot of damage. I didn't think it did. I thought it would do, like, 50. It did almost 100. Flying in a circle seems to be doing a good job, although it's speeding up. Okay, maybe this was the plan all along. Just stay back and use the Daedalus Stormbow. Man, this thing is so good. Oh, I'm about to die, though. It's at 98 health. Oh my god! 98 health. That might be one of the worst fails I've ever had on a boss before. I think we got this. I probably shouldn't have crafted two summons, I guess. Or maybe I want to fight it again. Who knows? Maybe it drops. I think it does actually drop a good bow. I mean, if we get it first try, that would just be amazing. But knowing my luck with with that like uh, gun that we got from the Hydra, that's not going to happen. All right. Well, there we go. Okay, we got Signal Booster. I think I used this before, actually. Oh, okay, that is a gun that I need to get. All right, well, I guess we'll just fight Ragaroth then. So, what do we need to fight or to, to summon him? Swirling Energies. Oh, if I remember correctly, this boss has a lot of health, and it was very difficult. It took me about 10 tries, I think, if I if I remember this fight correctly. I think I'm pretty sure you can... You can I, don't, I might be wrong, but I'm pretty sure... That this boss is a big worm. I, I'm I, I'm actually certain that it is now. We need a few higher up as well to spawn it in. But I think you can move down once you summon it in. Although I'm not 100% sure on that. Alright. Okay, we can spawn it in. Here we go. So, yes, this is the boss that I remember. It has a ton of health. Holy crap, look at the day of the storm bow. Um. Oh my gosh. Interesting. All right, I guess I'll use it then. We'll fight it again. Holy crap! What is this? What is this bow? I I die. I I mean I killed it. So hey, let's go. All right. Well, that's gonna end off today's stream. All right. I've done some stuff as in between as usual. I mainly just okay. So this is what happened. I got these, which is really cool. So the way that you make me is is um. Get wings, lucky horseshoe, the fire treads, and you combine these things post a mech boss. I guess we'll just look around. Oh, strange communicator. That's the thing that we need, I think. Yes, it is. Okay, here's the boss. So let's get rid of this. Okay. So I know it's it's down here. Challenge. Okay. Oh boy. Right, I need to get out of here quickly. Quickly. I should have said spawn point up there. That actually would have been smart. Oh. All right. Get up. Get up. Get up. All right. I'm up. <laughs> here we go. All right. First boss fight. So the mirage. Okay, so it only has 31,000 health. It looks like it has a lot of defense, though. Okay, yeah, it's really cool. I like it. It's, um... It, yeah, it's very Empress of Light feel to it. Where it's, like, moving, like, next to you, and it's really fast. Someone's in a bunch of projectiles. Oh, yeah. I don't know if Holy Arrows are the best for this, so we might have to use this. It's just less stuff on the screen, because it's kind of hard to tell if it's, uh, a, my projectile or its projectile. Let's use this. It does... Oh, my God. It does so much damage. Okay. Well, thankfully, we have 88 defense. <laughs> that armor gives so much defense. Okay, let's just keep doing this. Oh, I, I walked right into it. Yeah, it doesn't deal that much damage. Our defense right now is just really good. There we go. <gasps> Look at that. Wow, he tipped his hat. <laughs> I liked that. All right, we got elements of art. So this makes some magic stuff. Oh, there's a bow. Okay, that's a combination of a lot of stuff. I don't know if we're going to be able to get that. I did not make a very good bridge down. All right, break the bulb. Okay, here we are. We're down here now. This actually probably seems really good for Plantera because it's it's one enemy and it's really slow and easy to hit. Wow, look at that damage. Oh my god, and this is probably good against the uh, tentacles. Oh, they home in. Oh, okay, I'm actually really low here. Okay, maybe this wasn't a good such a good idea. Maybe having this teeny tiny arena wasn't the best idea. <laughs> okay, so where's the bulb again? Okay, it's up here. All right, let's do this. All right, I'm going to play it a little bit more safe this time. So instead of just going ham at it from the start and just going on top of it, I'm going to keep my distance. I'm a little concerned about the bouncing balls that she's going to summon because there are a lot of places that we can just like, you know, get stuck and stuff. That won't be good. I think once you go second form, I'll use the twins thing. I'm stuck. Why am I stuck? How do I keep getting stuck on something there. 
Yeah, like, <laughs> what do I do in that situation? If I can just survive a few more seconds. Nope, I can't. There we go. See, that was good. Okay, now I'm gonna beat it. <laughs> See, that was good. If you can just get it where it constant damage on the twins thing. Wait, am I actually gonna beat it? Yes, I am. Okay. <laughs> I got scared for a second. Dude, my health was really low. Okay, yeah, I'm not using that. <laughs> I'm not spam clicking. Uh, ooh. Mega Rocket. There's a weapon we can make. All right, I might get that. So, I'm gonna end off the episode here because <laughs> there's a lot to do. So, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Thank mm -hmm. you.